Grave Diggers, do I have something cool for you today? This is not uh, what we normally showcase here, but I'm really excited about this. It is a wrestling card game. You can get some more information about it in the links down below. There is a Kickstarter coming soon. Lots of good stuff here on this website. If you want to check this out, there's some videos on here and whatnot, but... I can do you one better because the game company that made this, uh, Cadian Arts, they sent me a pre-release copy. That's right. Oh, I better turn it the right way around. Uh, so this is this is the game. All right, this is the Kickstarter. I got an early copy. I was able to test this out, and I'm going to tell you all about it. I'm going to show you some of the stuff that's in the box, and uh, yeah, this is this is incredible. So not only is it a cool wrestling card game, but they also got the license to use the British Bulldog and Kurt Angle so far. I mean, if this thing does well, who knows what kind of wrestlers they can get into the game. Uh, so the story of the game is like, it's set in the future and some future billionaire is able to like revive wrestlers from the past and then wrestlers from the future and wrestlers from the distant past and uh, to stage some, stage some kind of grand battle royale. It's really cool. It's a great game. Uh, let me show you. So there's a couple of original wrestlers that were in the box and they each get their own um, card. With, it has their backstory on it, and the uh, the the uh, art on this is really cool as well. And then here's where the gameplay actually happens. So each wrestler has his own like special powers, and they each have different uh, stamina and health. And so those are the those are like the the ones. This is actually what got me interested in the game. Here was uh, I saw this guy on on Facebook. They had a picture of this guy, and I said. That's Kenny Omega, and he's doing a V-Trigger. I'm in. I, I'm all about that. He's not actually K uh, Kenny Omega. He's Jax Felix. Uh, he's another wrestler from uh, from Winnipeg, Canada. So not to be confused uh, with, with Kenny Omega, but dude, he's like totally Kenny Omega. Anyways, it's it's awesome. They got uh, car. It's a card game. Uh, that has some dice rolling involved in it as well. You can see there. There's the running the running knee. Totally not to be associated with the V-Trigger. But uh, yeah, very awesome. Uh, so some of the, like I said before, they got they got Kurt Angle in the game. There is a Kurt Angle. And he is very cool. And there is a British Bulldog. Man, I used to love the British Bulldog when I was a kid. In addition to that, and, and there's more coming. I don't know who else they got going on. They only told me so much insider information, which I'm going to share with you in a second. I do have some additional details on what's happening. Um, a couple of the uh, extra wrestlers you can throw into your Kickstarter, they got Andre the Giant. Now, of course, everybody knows Andre the Giant. I love his uh, back back photo there. All the cards look great. All the backstories are fantastic. And Randy Savage. Oh, yeah, it's the macho man. The cream rises to the top. Gotta love it. Um so very cool, very cool. Like I said, I played it with my daughter. My daughter's like 12 years old and the rules were a little complicated to get into at the start, but then it becomes very easy. In fact, everything kind of boils down to um, to one card full of rules. They have these like helper cards here, player aids that has a back and a front. And you can pretty much just play the game with these out in front of you to help. Once you play a couple of games and they have like basic rules and advanced rules in the box. So your first time playing, you can use the basic rules and then add more rules in later. Let me tell you about the campaign uh, before we head out here. And I'll be back too uh, to tell you more about this because I only played a couple of games. I haven't got to test out all the wrestlers. I really do want to do that. I did read through all the wrestlers. And yes, there is value here. Each of these wrestlers has a totally different play style totally different moves. Their combos work differently. There are card, it's actually a pretty in-depth game. Like the basic rules are, a, you know, pretty basic um, for lack of a better term, but the advanced rules, there's really a lot of strategy. I, definitely, um, I, I told the people making the game, the, the guy who designed this, they said, I can tell you really love wrestling and you really have a, a fine, a good understanding, an excellent understanding of, 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 card games and, and, and strategy and, and how, how to, it, it, it's so much more complex than most card play, games that you play, but not to the point where it's like impossible to, 
to access. So yeah, after a couple of games that was starting to make sense to me, I was starting to be able to, to use some more advanced strategies than just, you know, I'll just play this card or that card. Um, very cool game. All right. Anyways, I'll be back to talk more about the game. In fact, if I can get the single player rules, um, there are single player rules coming to this. I think there's actually a, they're really proud of like their campaign that they have on this where you can play it by yourself. So you don't even need to round up people for it, which is great because sometimes these Kickstarter games, they're like four player games and they sit on your shelf while you try to get three of your friends over to play some weird game that you bought on Kickstarter. That can be a little hard, but I'm really excited about this uh, solo campaign mode, which they're very happy, very proud of. Um, so that's going to be awesome. And yes, the Kickstarter is going to be launching on April 26th. The basic pledge is going to be for like a low price of like 29 bucks. And that's basically going to be this box right here. Um, Kurt Angle, Bulldog, you get the two um, of their own created wrestlers who I thought were awesome, just as cool as any of the, uh, the pros that are in there. And it's just a two player game. So it's a two player game. You got everything you need right here. If you want to step it up, to get Randy Savage and Andre the Giant, not only do you get Randy Savage and Andre the Giant, it's going to come with uh, the uh, tag match rules where you can play it with four players. Um, I need to get a hold of that too so I can try it with my whole family. I'll tell you how that is if I can get a hold of that before the Kickstarter goes live. Um, they're going to have a cage match. I have no idea what that's going to be about, but that's very exciting. And last man standing matches. And then finally, there's a third pledge level. And uh, this is the one that's going to have the solo campaign. Um, and it's going to come with two additional wrestlers who I don't know who they are. They won't tell me. Maybe I'll get that information and be able to share it with all of you here. Um, and that's going to have solo play and full solo campaign mode. Um, they're only looking, they're, they're, they're setting a very low bar to be funded on this. So if you get involved in this, I cannot see this not getting funded. This game is so cool, so interesting. You have the, you know, legacy wrestlers involved in it. You have the, the IP. I think it's going to be amazing. I'm really looking forward to seeing the other two wrestlers that will be in the box. Actually, I think one of them might even be here on the website. If I look at this closely... I think I'm finding, I, I think I found a secret wrestler right here, right there. There's some kind of like cyborg looking guy. Like I said, the game's set in the future. So I think they have a cyborg looking guy. And then I think over here they have a luchador. So another two um, of their creations. I think their created wrestlers are really, really cool. Speaking of their created wrestlers. Now I was talking uh, to the people that made the game and I said, Hey, I'm going to try to get my grave diggers involved in this. I'm going to try to get some, um, drive some traffic over to this site. Is there, is there, can we get a grave digger in here? Because one thing I'm noticing, okay, if you look at this, if you look at what they have here on the website, if you check this out, you know, we have Macho Man, uh, Andre the Giant, Kurt Angle. You got someone who kind of looks like Kenny Omega. Uh, you got uh, kind of a, Kind of an, uh, what's this guy's name over here? It's it's one they created themselves, uh, Mukundai uh, Shimba. He's kind of like, you know, maybe an Uso brother, kind of, you know, uh, Samoan wrestler that we've seen so many times in wrestling. You got a weird cyborg, that's cool. Luchador, great. Uh, Davey Boy, Kurt Angle. Uh, we, we're missing a kind of like, you know, the, 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 the Undertaker kind of character, right? Well, there's a lot of these in wrestling. You got The Undertaker, you got uh, over in AEW, you have Malachi Black, you have uh, Darby Allen, right? I said, hey, if I can get my gravediggers involved in this, if we can come out and show support for this, can we get a gravedigger inspired by Mr. Hartgrave and his following? Can we get that in the game? They said, yes. They said, yes, we can definitely do that. They're gonna need to, they're gonna need to really be funded for that to happen though. So definitely get out here. And what they said to me is if we can raise, if this, if this thing can hit over a hundred thousand dollars, which it did um, on Paracle, another game I was involved in. So if there's a good chance this could happen. They said they would create something for either this version or the next expansion. And that got me excited too, because I'm like, whoa, there's going to be more expansions to this thing. This is the kind of game where I would want to own all the expansions. I would want to get all the wrestlers because I really did have a blast playing it. I will play this more. I will definitely share with you what I think of the other uh, characters in the box, the other game modes. 
Uh, let me know what you think of all this down in the comments below. And make sure you like and subscribe because we'll have more of this coming here. Uh, maybe we can even get like a giveaway associated with all this. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. I think it's going to depend on how well the Kickstarter does. But uh, go out there. Uh, even if you don't back the thing, go go right on their uh, wall. Join their Facebook. Uh, keep Keep your eye on this. And keep digging.